Hello and welcome. This video is brought to you by TheStreamingAdvisor.com. Tailor your entertainment with streaming. And what we're going to look at in this video is how to set up a library to set up your Plex recordings. You'll notice here that we're going into where our servers are because my iMac is where my DVR is. We're going to click these dots here and pin it to the home page so that it's easy to find. And from there, we're going to move it. So we're going to move this to the top of the page. You're going to the three bars, the three dots. We're going to click reorder. And there it goes up to the top. Okay? So, when we access the DVR, you'll see that it gives you a lot of options. We have the guide right here, which shows you everything that is on on TV as far as over-the-air TV and we're going to go to the DVR schedule and you'll see that there are a couple of things set to record. Now how do you do that? You have to have a library set up on whatever computer or NAS you are set up to record your Plex on. That's whatever the server is on. So we're going to show you how you do that. Because if you don't, you'll get a message that says, you know, like, your recorder is not set up or unable to set up recording. So, you see that it's set up here. We're going to say we want to record forensic trials. I mean, sorry, forensic files. You have the choice to set up one episode at a time or all the shows. And it's set up to record to a folder called TV Shows. And what you'll see is that that's a folder on the desktop of my Mac here. You go into the uh, schedule and see now forensic files is there. It shows you what you've got. You can even do some modifications if you like. So that's that. We're going to go ahead and save this. All right. Okay, so next we're going to show you how this works. If you, because we already set up a folder with Plex that had TV shows in it, it already understands that we're going to TV. But, let's say you're going to start recording movies. And this would apply whether you were, you know, the first time you set it up anything. We're going into Guide, and let's click on here on, let's see, let's find a movie. Those are TV shows, da -de -de da Let's see. We'll go here to Countess Dracula on Comet. And we're going to click record. And you see, it says it will, you know, we don't have a library set for it, but we can create the library. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to click on create library. And boom. So now you see, it recognizes that it's a movie, and it even labels it like the, it's going to call the new library movies. You can call it anything you want, but for simplicity's sake, we're going to just leave it at that and click Next. Now is where you start having to think about what you're doing. So when you browse for the media folder, what this is going to do is open up the folders available on whatever you have your server on. Like I said, in this case, it's my Mac. And we're going to go in and make sure that we have a folder set up for this. So on my Mac, I'm going to go in and tell it to set up a recorder, a recording folder. So under File, let's see, it's not, it doesn't seem to be listed there. Let's see. Sometimes you have to click on the screen itself. So let's see if that does it. Yep. You know, clicking on the screen itself kind of clears it out so that it's not trying to communicate with something else. So we create a folder, and you see it's called Untitled Folder. So we're going to click on that folder, and we're going to name it Plex Videos. All right. And from here, I'm going to go ahead and combine the Plex TV shows there in with the Plex videos folder so that it's all in one place. Ta-da! 
Okay. So, now when we create our movies folder, we'll create it under the Plex videos folder and it'll all be nice and tidy. Okay. So, we could probably go forward from here, but I'm just going to cancel. And let's like start from the start. So, we're going to click record. It's going to ask us to create the library. We're going to say OK. Like I said, let's stick with movies. It makes it easy. And browse for media folder. And you see that I was using my desktop there. So, you know, the user is Ryan Downey. And we're going to save to the desktop. And now you find the folder that you created for it. And there it is, Plex Videos. So I'm going to click on that. And you see that you know, it already has the Plex TV shows in the folder. So we're just going to add this. And now we're going to click Add Library. And now we're able to record. See? Movies. It's adding it to the Movies folder and record boom now it's recording now that's pretty much it after that you know you should be good to go if you haven't set up your tv folder yet that's basically the steps it's going to be a little different you can cancel of course we'll do that but if you've never set this up before it's really that easy. It's a little bit different on a PC, but you just sort of follow the same basic concept. You want to go in, create a folder initially, you know, just maybe call it Plex. And from there, Plex kind of takes care of the rest for you. If you haven't seen the Plex DVR, there's a lot to it, but it has a section that allows you to just see what's on at the moment, you know, like live TV. In order to access it in general, you do need something like a, a tuner. In our case, we're using an HD Home Run tuner. There's some good things and bad things about all of this stuff, but that is it. I hope you found that helpful, and if you did, please subscribe to this channel and share it with your friends. As always, I'm Ryan Downey, the Streaming Advisor. Stream on, my friends.